Welcome back to Summit Sunrise here on TV8 Summit. I'm here at Olive Fusion in Brackenridge, which is a beautiful, unique store, and here with Crystal. She's the owner of Olive Fusion. And Crystal, she's going to let us know a little bit, some information about all these unique olive oils in here. So Crystal, tell us a little bit about what we have on this table. I've been admiring, I personally know white truffle oil, but tell us a little bit more about these olive oils and how they're made. Okay, well, right now we're standing behind the specialty um, oil section here we've got walnut oil um, we have the black truffle we have white truffle just a little bit of uh, history on our truffle oils they're actually steeped into the olive oil if you think of like a tea method um, so actually through steeping into olive oil no perfume no extracts nothing like that added to it to make it a truffle flavor so it's the real truffle our black truffle oil is interesting because it's um, um it's a late harvest truffle so it's very um I want to say earthy flavored. Mm. It's delicious. I love to put this on my pizza in place of sauce. Also, I make an awesome uh, mashed potato with it as well, with some of the black truffle. Yep. And then uh, it's nothing skinny about it, though. I use real, real cream. Oh yeah, no, I, I don't, I don't skimp on any of that. In, go in. <laughs> uh, that makes it taste so much better, though, doesn't it's, it? It's delicious. And then we have our white truffle, which is through the same process as well. Again, no perfumes or extract flavors added to it at all. This one um, is absolutely delicious as well, and a lot of you know different varieties that you can use with this too. Cool. And then we have our seed oils that are expeller pressed. Um, there is no uh, chemicals or high heat e extraction of to get the oil out. It's just expeller pressed from the seed. So we have our uh, butternut squash oil. Mm. We also have a pumpkin seed oil. Yeah, that's my personal favorite. And just to let you know, what can people use these uh, pressed seed oils for? What is it? Well, the pumpkin seed oil, I know a lot of people uh, use that over ice cream mm. and, you know, just some nice desserts. Uh, the Butternut squash oil is, you can go up to a high heat with that, so you can cook with that. I make a delicious Brussels sprout recipe where I slice the Brussels sprouts and then saute them in the butternut squash seed oil, kind of uh, caramelize them with my maple syrup, or maple balsamic, excuse me. Right. Um, so, Which I tried earlier and is to die for. <laughs> yeah. Now, I do have a little combination here for you to try at the end, which is the butternut squash oil with the maple balsamic, which is absolutely delicious. And, and you can use these nut uh, oils. It's, it actually adds a different flavor to your salads as well. Oh, I've yeah, had absolutely. them on there. So good. Um, so just for those that don't know, truffles are mushrooms, right? Yes. Okay. And where are they found? I know. Most people are like, not, the, not the chocolate that you eat as yeah, well. Yeah. Mainly it Italy, France. Um, yeah, I'll have kids come in, oh, truffle, and not the same. <laughs> but you either love truffle or you, you hate it. I mean, and people who love it, it's amazing. We'll have people come in and they might have a not so happy face on, and I give them some of our black truffle sea salt popcorn, and they do the happy dance. So <laughs> it's kind of nice to see that we can make people happy. Yeah. So come on in. We can make you happy. That's but, easy. Well, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm ready to try that. get happy, right? <laughs> oh, my gosh. It smells so good. Yeah. Oh, wow. Mmm. Oh my gosh. Mm. <laughs> so I have a few favorites in the store and then she just combined all of my favorites into one little, um, well, this was not the truffles. This was actually um, the pumpkin seed. Is that the, yeah, the, the squash. squash? The squash and the maple together. Oh my gosh. You could, this is, it's rich enough that you could almost have it on pretty much anything. So Crystal, this has been a pleasure. We've learned so much about all yeah. these wonderful things. Well, thanks for coming to my store too. And um, I've had a lot of fun and um, I'm done getting up at 530 in the morning. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, it's been fun. Well, we'll see Crystal again on Tuesday for another cooking show. And thank you guys so much. Definitely come in and check out the store. It is filled with so many wonderful things, and your mouth will be so happy as well. So we'll be right back after this short break.